Hello, I am once again on a screen near you. <laughs> so I thought I'd just do a little tiny update first because I wanted to explain what's been going on in my life right now. Today is my last day of work! Yeah, it's my last day of internship. Reached the end of my contract, everything is done and dusted. I am still at home but I'm going to head over to office later to return my laptop and all my stuff and I've already had my closing like exit talk with my boss it was really really nice and you know it wasn't the easiest thing for me and um, if I've talked to you before you would know that maybe corporate communications isn't really my thing and a lot of parts were challenging for me to deal with because I don't think I have like the character or kind of like traits needed to really thrive in that kind of environment but it was a good learning experience and I really really like all my colleagues I think they're all super sweet and have really guided me well throughout the past couple of months so I'm really thankful for that for the past two weeks I've also been involved in another kind of part-time or freelancing content role in a different company which is why I have been feeling really not burnt out yet but you know just quite hectic trying to manage these things and I know it was completely my choice I thought I could do it and I did but it came with its drawbacks so I have been quite like drained as of late but I'm very excited for the next chapter of my life which is what this really is since I'm ending my formal internship with the school and it's been like full-time working for so long already I'm excited to step into this new phase and just prep for my exchange meet all my friends because it's the year-end holiday season um, work on this other content role that I'm doing like I mentioned yeah I think there's a lot coming up and it's going to be a time of growth and renewal and love and spiritual awakening and also a time of reflection I think that's very important and try to do your best just keep doing your best mm. so I guess uh, and like I said uh, okay I'll definitely remember it you really hurt me you told people that you broke me And maybe you did And maybe you did But I'm not over it How the hell do I get over this? I just handed in my things so I'm free <laughs> I guess taking one last look at this place which you guys are familiar with by now A lot has happened here or I've given a lot of updates here next to this view and I think it's like coming full circle I will try to do a video or like a blog post on this entire internship journey because it definitely deserves that space I guess it hasn't hit me yet that like I won't be working full time anymore for for at least like another year or so. Let me just show you guys what I'm seeing. It never looks as impressive as it does to me in real life, but I really can't get enough of this view. Now that this is over I feel a little colder <laughs> You shut me down You shut me down But this is all just irrelevant 
trying to find a way to remember this Cause even though it hurts It hurts so good But when you have my hand I'm not a winter song she just started dinner. I'm <laughs> like, nobody else is at the table. All right, Emma started the main course already. In fact, everyone at this table got bonus except for me. <laughs> it's incomparable to add bonus. Let's be real. Well, it's okay. You got me. No, no, I'm getting my later. What do you mean? Uh, my company's end of financial year is in June, not in December. So. Oh. Yeah. Doesn't matter. I'm gonna go with the same thing, right? <laughs> and then I uh, click on her for a shopping candy like immediately. She said, "Why so free, ah?" I'm like, "Hello." Wait, can I swap? You give me your hers. Why? 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 now getting breakfast, it's it's lunch. Okay, so we are intending to make brunch, but <laughs> now it's um, approximately 12.30 and we are super late. This is a ali focaccia. We're thinking of getting mushrooms. Damn, uh, your arm looks damn swole. <laughs> 
No, it is. Oh, they are not in plastic. I have a bad experience. Breakfast has been cooked and it's now on the table. Breakfast at 1.30. I mean, what time is it? 1.30? Yeah, it's 1.45. Okay, I mean lunch. First meal of the day, but lunch. And it's nice. We've got focaccia, mushrooms, eggs, sausages, a regular brunch, some juice. And the veggies are still cooking in the oven, but I think we're too hungry to wait, so we'll probably start first. I just wish my hunger was starving. I'm crazy. It's gonna be on the outside one. <laughs> I am back in cat. In the flying seat specifically because we're going to have a CSC gathering. No, like dinner and um, gift exchange. Did that last year also. So I decided to meet here and the rest are coming. I just happened to reach the earliest. This is here. <laughs> Why are you Why are you fooling? Why are you It's the blue dog. <laughs> the man himself. Yeah, the man, the man himself. The myth, the legend. <laughs> hey, wait, wow. no, you should find your name. And then like... Where is it? I can't be done. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, okay. okay. Then take my one, then take my okay. one. Just like... Okay. Oh, thank you. 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 Good morning, it is now Sunday and um, I was really tired last night after the CSE gathering so I kind of just went straight to bed but it was really fun and I don't know, I think I walked out of it feeling that my heart was really full even though not everyone was able to make it I think December is like a time of meeting all my friends or has been a time where I would where I'm able to meet everyone 
in my life even the ones that like I don't see regularly and it reminds me of how lucky I am to have so many groups of people in my life that you know I can just spend time with and reminisce about the past or talk to each other about life and share in that yeah so it was really it was really nice to play games with him we played Avalon which is like resistance like one of those games where you have to find out who's the bad guy Gavin's girlfriend even brought us a cake which was really really cute I was totally not expecting that that was so sweet of her because it had our names on it and of course we also had our gift exchange that was also really fun Candace was my Santa and she got me exactly what I wanted so I was really really happy about that thanks Candace if you're watching I really need to get some chores done before I leave the house later to go for brunch with Ivan so I'm going to do some cleaning, some washing and um, maybe try to talk to you guys along the way so it doesn't get too much of a cleaning vlog I don't know if you guys like that content but we need to get down to business a bit of washing um, but I didn't get to clean my room but it's fine I can do it another day I guess I just wanted to talk about feelings or like how I have really been feeling the past few weeks because to be honest it hasn't been great partly because of this new work that I've taken on which I've mentioned uh, before yeah just general thinking about things that have happened in my personal life like with friendships and all of that which is why I've also been quite reluctant to film about stuff for me whenever I get stressed and stuff I will start to break out which is why um, I've had more breakouts recently especially like around my mouth and chin area which is where uh, I guess like hormonal breakouts happen more often it's like a vicious cycle because like then I'll break out and then I'll get even more stressed and like upset and then I'll get even more and I don't have any real solution for it I'm not sharing any pearls of wisdom on like what to do when this kind of stuff happens because I'm still figuring it out too but I'm trying to be grateful for the small things yeah it's all about finding a coping mechanism that works for you and for me, I think that is generally being creative and being able to have like an outlet for things. I feel the best when I am creative or so-called through any form really, it doesn't really matter. But I feel the best when, when I'm doing that. So... <sighs> We'd be riding the same wave All the water's perfect, babe The heat is rising The time is melting from your fingertips So nothing compares to this Better than You and I are making fire I can take ya We're at dinner now, hence the outfit change. What? 
I always had it. Online lab. Yeah. Who I've literally vlogged with this like in front of you before. <laughs> Yeah. I spent the rest of the night finishing Light the Night, a Taiwanese drama on Netflix I started watching with Emma and Dorcas. So I wasn't really able to fully express my feelings in this vlog because I struggle to be vulnerable online, especially with things that matter to me in my heart. So maybe one day I'll be able to share. But in retrospect, right now I feel quite healed and happy, especially with my internship finished and seeing all my friends in this season. So that's all for now and I'll see you very soon.